back to another planning life for there and i'm erin and in this video i'm going to be planning in my happy planner big that i use for journaling and memory planning um and i'm planning for the week of july 4th through july 10th i can't believe like fourth of july is just right around the corner um for this spread i'm going to be using planet darby her fourth of july stickers printed them out i have some different sizes going on here um and when I, when I plan in my journal, um, I tend to kind of go, not overboard with decorative things, but um, I have more freedom to be a little bit more creative and it has to be less functional. Um, so with that being said, I also like to have boxes that I can write in. So I'm gonna pull in Mojo Jojo um, boxes, her gray, because there's a really light gray in here that almost looks white. Um, red and blue. So let's start with, we're going to start with box. I think I would like to start with that. Um, and I think I want to do a good size red lined box. So I can write all about the 4th of July. So we're going to my cousin's house and have a nice cookout. So I definitely have some things to write about. Let's see. I do like this red, white, and boom. My favorite thing about um, 4th of July is fireworks. Although I have not really gotten a chance to see very many fireworks since my kids were born because they don't necessarily like fireworks. They don't like the, how loud they are. They like them in theory. All right, let's see. I've got... A red box. Let's do a. Um, how do I want to do this? Hold. I might have another idea. I kind of want to throw in some of these and have like a firework near it. How's that look? Okay, I like that. And then let's do a red star. and blue firework. All right, I like that. Pull that over a bit. I wanna do, <clears throat> excuse me, let's go for a light gray box. light gray and then blue. So we've got the red, white, and blue going on. I think I want to, I'm like running out of blue squares. Do I want to add in? No, I don't think so. I think I want to do, gosh, I'm going to need more boxes. Because my husband said that I wouldn't need boxes again. Well, I'm proving him wrong. I actually think I want to move this down and then we'll add in some fireworks there also. Let's see. Okay. So far, I am liking how this looks. Let's see what else we have for quotes. Born to sparkle, land of the free, home of the brave, happy birthday America. Let's do happy birthday America. And then we'll throw in some stars at the bottom and along the side. We'll do fireworks and stars kind of coming up. All right. So I need to white out this line from there to there. Let's get my pen and just take care of this whole line. Also want to get rid of this. Oh, I think 
this might be running out and that's why it's not working right. Okay. I also have washi. Maybe, what if I ran the washi this way? Let's try it. I need to get a new exacto knife. This one is very dangerous for me. I can't get the cover, the cap to stay on. So I don't know if I'm not doing it right or if I broke it somehow. I've had it for a while. I got it when I got my um, my Cricut. So when I go to pick it up sometimes, the cap comes off and then there's a knife flying at me. So I've been looking at the retractable knives on Amazon. I think it's, um, I can't remember the brand now. It'll come to me. But I think I might grab that because it seems like it'll be the safest for me. My husband gets nervous when I'm around sharp, sharp objects. Try to keep these spaced as evenly as I can. And then we'll layer the other stickers on top of them. I think this is going to look great. I love this idea. And I don't know which um, I will post first, but I also did, oops, I also did um, a plan with me, my classic, my catch-all vertical for the 4th of July. And basically why I'm leaving the, I'm leaving the space between the red and the blue. So that white space works as the white because I don't, I don't have white washi tape. We'll do another red. I think I'm eyeballing these, okay? A little trim any excess that I might have missed. Do I have one for one blue? Let's see. I think I do. works. Okay, sorry about that. I had a problem in the video. My daughter needed help with something. But guys, look at that. That looks so good. I like it. Okay, so now I gotta put all this down and figure out how to get it back down on there. I don't think I can pull it up with one so we're gonna do it in parts if I have to. If not, yay. Oh. Okay. So we want to do you want to adjust this because this one's not straight. Oh, I think it's the red one that's not straight. Let's see if we can get this a bit straighter so then the whole cluster isn't crooked. Oh, much better. Pull this down here. Tuck this in a little bit more. 
Ooh, so cute. I might want to use a bigger firework over here. Maybe we'll add another bigger one there. Okay, got these down. So cute. Okay, so down here, what do we want to add? Maybe some stars. We'll have the stars coming. I don't want to go for the biggest one, but I want a big one. Stars kind of coming off this. Do something like that. I feel like it's, um, it kind of looks like America's Got Talent. Like the beginning of there, or I think it's the credits. I haven't seen that show in so long. It just reminded me of that. All right, let's see. Okay, I like that. I need to get a general idea. And then I tend to change it when I put it down on the paper for the just want to make sure I like it first. I will link Darby's shop down in the comments. I've been really loving printing out my own stickers lately. I actually haven't, the only sticker book that I've actually used is um, Live Love Posh, Hello Summer, and Hello Spring. But other than that, I've been like weeks on in now, I think. I've been printing stickers and I really love it because I feel like it's more like, oh look, this is the mood that I'm in today. So I'm gonna grab these and print them. And also, my Cricut likes me. So, so far so good, still liking me. That looks so cute. I like that. Um, I'll add in a few more stars. I'll do like this size is a good size. Do a couple coming down over here. Grab some red. So I've printed so many uh, different uh, sticker sheets that I actually, I figured out, I just grabbed one of my um, Happy Planner notebooks, the bigs, and um, made some molds and put them in the book. Works great. It's a nice little tip for you. You have them all over the place and you need to be organized, like, or as bestly organized as you can, like I do. Let's see. This born to sparkle. But I don't know. It might be too much right there, so let's see. another box here and then I can have another little box coming out here to make sure I have some space to write. Well this is pretty nice. Um, maybe I don't want that there. Let's see if I can get it. All right we're going to put that 
off to the side for a second because I want to. I like this Born to Sparkle also. Um, I want to add in some more boxes right here. So I've been kind of going with like the red, white, and blue. Um, but I don't know how that will look so close to each other. So let's see if I have, I might not even have any more lined blue boxes. Though Mr. Weston used them for his project. And I don't think I have any more. Yeah, okay. So we used all those, apparently. So maybe we go with, oh, I lied. I've got them. I don't have any white ones though. box here have another nice little writing space and we'll add in another gray box and we'll do a gray square do you want to add it in here I feel like that's too close to that now so maybe we want to do red like my kids might eat me so I'm gonna have to stop the video but we'll get this for firework here I think let's see these are cool designs too but I think I'm gonna wait on using this one might use that for a memory plan and let's add in Cute, I like that. And we will add this in up here. I don't know if I like it like that though. Sweet. I'm gonna add some more stars here. something I'm going to want to write about that I know of yet anyways. So maybe let's get my my tissue, my wax paper. Oh my goodness. Let me put that here. you know what I think I'm gonna do an online box tore this a little bit by accident be careful with it tear it again Let's see. 
do have another quote, bold stripes, bright stars, brave hearts. I think I want to put that one next to this because of the heart. Maybe we add it in the middle. We'll do more fireworks up top. Yes, okay, I like that. And let's start by putting the washi down first. Am I in frame? I always get out of frame with my big. And then I forget to check. Ooh, I am loving that. So cute. All right, I wanna add in the fireworks at the top. I think I can move my wax paper off to the side for now. I'll add in some fireworks. Ah, see, dangerous with my knife. So awesome. Sorry. I really like that. Um, and then I think I want to add in another one. That seems like it's kind of close to that, but it's okay. I do want to add in another box down here to write. So we have two gray, two red, two blue. So I'm going to do another red, white, and blue. So we'll start with the red, if I can find my book. <clears throat> And I'll do red. And I'll do a rectangular or a double box of lines since we don't have a white one with lines yet. And we'll do a smaller blue. Okay, so how do we want to do this? Add this in. I might do it this way. And put a blue one here. Let's do like a blue square. If I have any. I'm running low, so maybe we'll do. I think I like that. Let's add that in. I don't need these books anymore, so I'm gonna push those off. And maybe we add in some washi down here. It'll make it longer. I don't know if that looks weird. Sorry, right. I'm gonna leave it. I'm not gonna stress. Just left like a little tiny space right here, but I'm not gonna stress about it. It's fine.
feel like that's a little crooked, but I think it's okay. It might bother me a little bit. That's good, better. Okay. Oh, I love this. It's so cute. I'm really liking this a lot. Okay, so we're going to do some more of these stars. So cute. And I think I'm going to throw, throw in a couple more fireworks. Let's see. Blue. I want to make sure I have some room to write for Sunday. This, oh, you know, aside from this, I can write this way. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for me this week. I'm absolutely loving this spread. I think it's so cute, definitely feeling festive, and I cannot wait to fill this in. Um, I'm thinking I'll probably use some like red, a red Tombow and a blue Tombow and some black. Oh, it's gonna be great. Um, so again, for this spread, I used Planet Darby Firework in it, her kit. Um, you can, I will link her Etsy shop down below. Um, go check her out. I love her things are so adorable and I love the fact that I can print them out and even if I didn't have a cutting machine I would still be able to cut them um, whether I use an exacto knife or scissors or whatever um, It's really great because once you buy it once you have it forever and it's been nice because I've been able to print out some stickers for my uh, my daughter to use but anyways, so thank you so much for spending some time with me today. I truly appreciate it. Um, I know we're all busy, so taking that time out of your busy day uh, means a lot to me. So if you have not hit that subscribe button yet, go ahead and do so now so you don't forget. And if you like this video, give it a like, and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye. Bye.